A grandmother is grieving the loss of her son and now grandson, both killed by gun violence. Five-year-old Tenarius Moore Jr. was killed yesterday, caught in the crossfire between two family members. WVTM 13's Bria Douglas is now live in Birmingham. And Bria, you spoke to the grandmother tonight. How's she holding up? Sherry, Cherie Moore was at a unity walk for her grandson and she says she's devastated about his passing and questions why she lost two family members to gun violence. I know you don't supposed to question God, but I have a lot of whys. A father and son gone too soon. Now the matriarch left praying for an understanding. My son leaving at 25 and his son leaving at the age of five. It's like I'm so numb until I'm hurt, I'm disappointed, I feel let down, and I just don't know why God chose those two. In just two years, two generations killed from gun violence in the same Collegeville community. The deja vu too much to bear for Cherie Moore. I go to grief counseling, I have a therapist, I have a psychiatrist, I take medication, and just the support from my family because I would have been lost it. This picture of Tenarius Moore Sr. embracing his son on earth and now in eternity is what gives Moore a sense of comfort. I'm also speaking for his dad who's in heaven and I'm pretty sure that he greeted his son with open arms when he crossed over. And one suspect is in custody for the murder of TJ Moore. No charges have been filed at this time. Live in Birmingham, Bria Douglas, WVTM 13.